I'm feeling kind of springy today. Let's see what I can do. Ooh, cute. Ooh, yes. Hi guys, Jenny with Jenny Squad here, and I'm back today for another Dollar Tree haul. As always, I am very excited to show you what I found, but real quick before I get into the haul, thank you for those of you that took time out of your day to come watch my video. For those of you that are new, I do Dollar Tree hauls along with Dollar General hauls and hauls from other stores I shop at. That's all I have for today. Now, let's get into the haul. All right, guys, so I have a very random haul for you today, but a very good one. So I'm super excited to show you what I found. I'm gonna jump right in. First, I wanted to show you that they have these hats at Dollar Tree now, and they are so cute. So these are definitely back in style. I asked my daughter if, um, if these were in style. She said yes, she knows better than I do. But these are adorable, oh my gosh. And these ones have little lemons on them. I think it's just so cute. I will also pop another picture here showing um, some of the other designs that they had, but these two were my favorite. So I got the lemon one. And then I got the one with little bees on it. And how cute is this? Oh my gosh, I just love this. And actually when I was younger, I used to wear hats like this because that was what was in style back then. Now I will say that these are very thin but there's nothing wrong with that to me. Um, it is by the Juncture label again. I feel like these are pretty much like paper thin. They kind of actually feel like a, a weird kind of papery material too a little bit but they're just so cute and I feel like in the summer it would be cute um, or it would be nice to have a little bit of a lighter hat to wear anyways but tons of different designs really really cute and you cannot beat it for a dollar like this is just adorable to me so i am very happy i found those and then i found some paper plates uh for the summer and they are the cutest so i found this little pineapple plate uh this comes with 12 pieces and it's just a really cute design. I don't think I've ever seen this one before. Uh, this looks like more of like the tiki kind of the tiki line that they usually have where it's kind of like the outdoorsy tiki bar type thing. But I did find these plates and then I also found these plates. I think they had these before. Uh, I want to say last year. There's Graham. Um, but I really love when they do this fruit theme because I really love anything that has like these little fruits on it. I think it's just super cute. And then I also found these little watermelon plates and how cute are these? There's 12 of these as well. Oh, I apologize. And 12 of these as well. So all of them have 12, but they also had other fruits as well. I believe they had oranges, lemons, and they had a watermelon, and I think they had one other one. I can't remember off the top of my head, but the design of this is so adorable. Like for outside, when you're having like a little picnic or something, grilling, it's just really adorable. So I grabbed those for the summertime. And then I also found this really cute pineapple plate. I wanna say they did something similar to this last year. This one's kind of a holographic. I don't know if it's got kind of a pearlescent sheen to it but it's plastic and it's just really cute to put like little you know whatever little hors d'oeuvres or whatever you want on here for the summer just a really cute little plate that you can get um and they had different colors too i just got this kind of white pearlescent one but so cute love and then i found this little wall cling which was adorable i'm really been i've really been into like bees lately for some reason like bumblebees and things like that i think they're so adorable but this says be happy and i feel like i need to look at this every once in a while especially during these times you know you just kind of got to remind yourself it's not as bad as it may seem you know at times but um, I just think this is a really, really cute wall cling. So I'm actually probably going to put this in my kitchen. Um, 
I don't have a lot of like wall clings around or anything. I have like one maybe like in the living room. It just says be grateful, but I do really like this one and I thought it was really pretty for spring. And the good thing about these is you can always change them out. You can also stick them on something more permanent if you want like a piece of wood kind of Mod Podge over it maybe or something like that to keep it from, you know, moving or, or falling off. But just adorable, really, really nice. They have really cute wall clings right now. So that was a really good find. Um, I also found this really cute glass and it's plastic, so it's perfect for outside. I just got one, there were a few different designs. This one says, hello, sweet summer. And I, again, I love the fruit on it. Um, I love these kind of glasses, the stemless like wine glasses to me, I don't drink wine, but like when I drink anything out of a, this glass, it tastes so much better to me. I know that is like the silliest thing ever, but it just really looks refreshing to me when it's in one of these glasses. So I did pick this up. I think it's adorable. So I'm super happy I picked that up as well. And then I found these little kind of party buckets, super random, right? But how cute are these for like, birthday parties or little just get togethers that you have if you're having ki like kids over or anyone really. Um, I'm going to insert a picture here. They had different designs and there's so many different kinds of these like little buckets now and you can do so many things like put little treats in here for people. Uh, I just think these are adorable and I really loved the panda so I grabbed this to show you guys but it's just so cute like for a little like I said little get togethers or party favors for birthday parties and things like that you can't go wrong so it's adorable love it I also love all the little choices that they have now um and then Dollar Tree now has pop sockets which if you don't know what a pop socket is it's one of those things that you stick on the back of your cell phone that you can kind of pull out and you know put it between your fingers so when you're holding your phone like this it's not uncomfortable you can kind of hold it without worrying about it slipping out of your hands and things like that. So this is a pop socket that I found at Dollar Tree and I cannot believe that they have these there. And I have heard good things. So I've heard that these stay on very well, which is great. And all you do is pull the adhesive off and you stick it to the back of your phone. So this is I don't recommend sticking it directly on your actual phone, probably a phone case, but um, this is really, really cool to find at Dollar Tree for just a dollar because pop sockets sometimes are very expensive. So that is awesome that you can find those at Dollar Tree. Also, I found these new ring holders. So this is a ring holder, similar concept. It's just a ring that kind of pops out that you can set, um, like it shows you a picture here. You can hold it like this or you can set your phone up like this to watch it. I currently have a ring on my phone and it works perfect. It doesn't move, doesn't fall off. Um, so these are awesome to find at Dollar Tree. I think I have a photo, if I do, I'll insert it here, of other ones that I saw there as well because there were different designs in both the pop socket and the ring holder. So super cool that you were able to get these for just $1. Amazing, amazing find. Also, I found this, so this is very interesting. It is a phone disco light. How weird is this? So when, I don't know when you would want a phone disco light. You guys tell me, I don't know, what would you use this for? I have no idea, but it's um, it just has like a little USB plug. You plug it into your phone. It looks like it's for um, Android phones more. Um, it's definitely not for like an iPhone, but it says plug into phone charging port and play music. And then it kind of, you know, does this little disco-y thing. I would show you, but I don't have an Android, so... I can't really show you what it would look like, but I'll give it to my sister. She has an Android just to kind of see how this works. So I'm very curious, but super unique find uh, for a dollar. So I thought I would show you guys that. This is another really cute phone ring strap and it has the little pom-pom on the end here. It's just cute. It's like a cutesy little thing that you can have on your phone. I don't know how annoying that pom-pom would get. Um, you know, using it on your cell phone all the time, but it's just a little cutesy thing to have. So, you know, 
I wanted to show you guys that they did have these kind too. So those were really cute. Um, I got a bunch of hand soaps. So they have a bunch of new ones that I've never seen before. And look how pretty these are. So these are from Bolero. They changed up their packaging, which I love. I love this like cylindrical little kind of thing they have going on right now. And the label itself, it looks like Victoria's Secret to me or something like that. Um, but it says hibiscus rose, extra love for all skin types. And it's just a soap. And I absolutely love this. Like if I could have grabbed, I could have grabbed, I guess, a bunch, like a whole bunch, but I didn't um, because I do have a lot of soaps around, but I thought these, this was really pretty for spring. So I grabbed this one. And then I also grabbed this chamomile and cucumber one. And look at this label. I know it's just packaging, but it really does do a lot for the eye. Like, you know, when you see something that looks like this or that you think looks really good, you know, you're kind of drawn to it. And I just love the way Bolero is doing their hand soap right now. Like this is so pretty. And um, this is Calm, Nourish, and Hydrate, but just so cute. Love it. And then I picked up some Ocean hand soap. So ocean-themed hand soap, I should say. Um, usually they have the one with just the fish, but this time I was super excited to see that they had different designs. So this one's a little starfish. And it looks like on the inside, it kind of like, you can kind of move it around a little. It kind of jiggles, but it's really cool. So I grabbed the starfish one. And this is Lemon Splash Scent. So this one. And then I also grabbed this one, which was super cute. I love little sea turtles. And this one is very berry scent. So they're all different scents. They also had a dolphin one and the fish one. And then I want to say there was one other one, but I can't remember what it was. Um, but they do have a lot of those there now and it seems like because they're going in the theme of beach at Dollar Tree this year that they have those there as well which is awesome. So I grabbed those. Another very random find is Baker's Twine. So I've actually come across like recipes and things where I actually needed Baker's Twine and I didn't have any because I've never purchased it before. So to find it for a dollar is pretty cool just in case I need it. Um, they had all different colors. I don't know if the color matters really. You could also probably use this for like crafting if you wanted to, but I bought it just for the kitchen if I need it. But I thought it was pretty cool to get this much of it for just a dollar. It's in the Crafter Square section. So super cool find on this too. So I grabbed that. And then I found this random, this random guy here. So another dog toy. We will see how he handles this, but um, hopefully he doesn't tear this apart. But I did get this for him because he is the destroyer of all toys. So I grabbed this one, hoping that it will hold up. It feels pretty strong, but again, I've said that before, and he's just demolished it so we'll see but I'll give him that and then I found a couple hair accessories I thought these were super cute it's fourth of July it's kind of early but really really cute um little stars and stripes and then it also comes with just a navy blue scrunchie so I thought you know me and my daughter could use these if if we wanted to um if we're feeling festive but yeah so we did grab a couple of those and then I found these Sincerely Jewels and it's by Sc Scoonchy, I want to say, or Scunchy. I don't know how, how to say their, their name, but it's name brand. And I found these really pretty like pearl barrettes. So these are really nice quality, obviously, because it is name brand. So I love these. I think they're really pretty. And I grabbed this for just a dollar. This is also a really good gift for anyone who does do things with their hair like that um, or like, you know, teen girls or yourself like I would I'm probably going to wear these for myself so I think these are really pretty um my daughter isn't really into pearls really that much I am so I'll wear those with no problem at all so um super happy I found those that is all I have for today but I thought 
that those were some really good finds, things that I have not seen before. So I'm very excited to be able to share that with you. And I look forward to seeing you again next time. And I will see you later. Bye, guys.